Hi guys, the Savage Kid here, back with another YouTube video, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys all my Rubik's cubes. So yeah, even though I don't really know how to solve any of these. <laughs> so first we have this. Uh, it's kind of crappy because I used it a lot. It's this um, very noisy, loud Rubik's cube. It's it moves really well and stuff, but it's just crappy as you could kind of. Uh, as it sounds but yeah i think i don't know if this is a good brand or not but whatever yeah this is the first cube i pulled out okay so i have this angry birds cube in here i've actually got another one that my cousin gave me but i already have one but hey this one's solved so that's cool but and i already mixed this one uh up as you could clearly tell i might try and solve it but like i said i don't know how to solve any of them but yeah two rubik's cube uh angry birds rubik's cubes and let's move on to the next one this one i like a lot it's actually uh better than this one it's actually a three by three three by three rubik's cube uh made from the rubik's brand now these are noisy too but it just sounds nice to me i like it better than this noise because that this is like really annoying but yeah i have this uh three by three and let's move on to this other christmas one over here okay so i have this christmas one i haven't scrambled it yet but yeah it's really hard to turn so i don't really know how i could scramble that my friend gave me this in school uh but yeah christmas one but yeah now I have this one, and this has a hole in the middle. This is really cool. Once again, I haven't scrambled this one either. But yeah, this is really cool. It turns pretty... It, it's really hard to turn, but once you get the hang of it and start moving it around each day, it just gets looser and looser, so that's pretty cool. And here we have this awesome 2x2 two two that I actually really love. Um, just amazing 2x2. Two two. I love the Rubik's brand, even though they're pretty noisy. It does, it just makes, they just make good Rubik's Cubes to me. A lot of people hate it because of the noise and stuff, but I think they make good cubes, so yeah, let me know what you guys think of the Rubik's brand. I think they're really cool, but yeah. We actually have another Christmas cube, and this one I had ever since I was a baby. It's really scrambled up, as you could tell, but yeah, <laughs> really scrambled. But yeah, I don't think it's, it doesn't look that hard to solve. You know what? Never mind, it really does. Actually, I don't know why I said that. This one isn't scrambled either, but it has weird shapes. Not weird shapes, but has random shapes, I should just say. So, oof, it actually turns pretty nice. I never realized. It's one of the ones you have to like, turn it. Like this one, you have to turn it to get the hang of it. But this one moves way smoother, as you can probably tell. Uh, it doesn't make a lot of noise, so yeah, this one's a pretty cool one. I like this one a lot. These are all, I think this is Steelers. I'm not a, yeah, NFL players. So yeah, NFL players, uh, it's not just Steelers. Um, but I thought it was Steelers because I'm a fan of the Steelers. But yeah, Steelers right here on this side. But these are just NFL players in general. Pretty cool football cube. It's not scrambled either, as you might tell if you're a football fan or you could just tell in general but yeah awesome nfl uh cube this one i like a lot this is an awesome it's it falls out of your hands easily but it's a really cool one it's this uh rubik's ball that's really cool it feels nice but like i said it falls out of your hand uh sometimes but i mean it's a ball and it turns so what do you expect okay so my sister broke one of these but i got another one from christmas Ooh, this next one i might show you is awesome i might save that for the last i'm not sure anyways this one my sister broke but then i got a new one for christmas like i said uh but yeah awesome x cube whatever you want to call it i forget what it's called i have to look it up but um yeah very cool cube i suggest you get it i got this at target so you might find it there as well i'm just gonna do this one now this is the smallest rubik's cube in the world it's not like exclusive you could you could get it anywhere like i think i saw one at target too this is a very cool rubik's cube i saw it at gamestop as well but yeah i saw it at a video game store they have rubik's cubes there so that's pretty cool but 
yeah, it's a very cool Rubik's Cube. Hard to turn a little, tiny bit hard to turn. But once you, like, move it around a lot, like, um, with a bunch of other ones, you'll really get the hang of it. So, yeah, very cool, cool smallest Rubik's Cube in the world. I don't really know if these should count or anything, but... Okay, so, it looks like a 2 by 2 but really, when you go like that, like that, it turns into this thing. Now, no, you cannot solve these or anything. It's just cool to fidget and mess around with. So, this is one version of that, and the other one... It, this one looks like it's scrambled, right? But over here, we have this one that's not scrambled, it looks like. Even though these can't really scramble, as you can see, I cannot turn it either sides. But, uh, yeah, this one folds too, like this. And, yeah, very cool. Um, cool to fidget around with. I fidget around these on Christmas, because I got these for Christmas. I got a lot of these from Christmas, but, yeah, very cool, uh flippy cube whatever you want to call it this is the second before last the last one isn't cool or crazy or anything but this one's a pretty cool one this one is like literally made up of balls it looks really cool it turns well like really well i'm quite surprised about that but yeah very cool ball cube um whatever you want to call it i called this one a ball cube but this one is like literally made out of balls so this is really cool and yeah let's move on to the last one it's nothing special or anything it's just a regular three by three except a tiny bit smaller so yeah let's get to that last one right now so here we have this one um like i said it's a little bit smaller from the regular regular three by three wait look at these okay so we're gonna compare these this one okay so this this and then you have the smallest rubik's cube in the world right here that's just cool. That's crazy. But, uh, yeah, this one turns pretty well, too. I'm quite surprised because it's pretty small, too. But, yeah, it turns pretty well. It's scrambled and everything. But, yeah, awesome Rubik's Cube. And, yeah, that's it for today. So, we're so close to hitting 2,000 subscribers. It would be greatly appreciated if you could smash that like button. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, smash the like button. And maybe subscribe and help me hit 2,000. Thank you so much for your support recently. It's been crazy. Thank you so much for watching. Please like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.